Five scary ghost videos to give you more nightmares. Top five scary ghost videos caught on camera. When horror becomes horror. This next clip was sent in to me by Andrew Barahona, a filmmaker for Board Film Studios. Andrew was filming a scene for a horror movie in the historic and allegedly very haunted Doña Ana County Courthouse in New Mexico. Bad idea. In the scene they are filming, the actress Chelsea is meant to be acting overcome with fear. Okay. Because in the movie scene, a killer is supposed to be stalking her through the building's hallways. But acting frightened soon turns into very real terror. Keep going, keep going, keep See it? See it? The filmmaker and the oh actress are the only ones God. on the third floor of the courthouse, but suddenly a startling and very real door slam can be heard from somewhere nearby. Yeah, I just got goosebumps. I just got goosebumps. It's appreciate the gift, bro. You're telling me you're, you're filming a horror and they literally snap out of acting mode, bro. Someone else wanted to be in a horror video. Nah, yeah, fuck that. What? Yo, she was scaring me alone. Never mind the extra horror stuff. She was, she was doing a good job, mate. I was terrified. The filmmaker and the actress are the only ones on the third floor of the courthouse. But suddenly a startling and very real door slam can be heard from somewhere nearby. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> then both of them hear some very odd whispering that sounds like it's hey. right in the room. Yo, with they should keep it in the video though, because that's actually scary, bro. That, that, that actually be a good segment in the video. Um. In the movie. Wait, 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 wait. Turn the light back on. Oh, <laughs> the actress immediately asked that the lights be flipped back on. And the filmmaker is so startled that he turns his camera off. Fuck that. Hey, well, you're not really a good filmer then, are you, buddy? You're telling me you're filming a horror movie? You're, you're literally experiencing a horror movie and you turn it off? You dumb motherfucker. You dumb mother... Bro, you need to go to, like, film school or something, my guy. Bro, you literally got a free horror movie for you right there. Know what I'm saying? You don't even need to do any acting. It's right there, bro. So at the time, I had the camera in my hand and I almost reacted immediately when I heard it. It was like it was next to me. And so uh, she said she saw something behind me and we just booked it. Now, when I isolated and enhanced the audio of the strange whisper, it sounds like this. Subscribe to Alfred WG. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> now, of course, since this clip came from a professional filmmaker, I was especially skeptical. But I think the footage, along with their very believable reactions, speaks for itself. Hey, 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 but you can't really, like, yo, they were believable reactions, but you can't believe their reactions. Because we already know she's an actress. You know what I mean? They're good at what she, she you know, she's good at what she does. But either way, it's scary, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I won't be there. I won't be there. In security. I won't be there. An overnight guard at the Costa Rican Electricity Department begins to hear scary sounds while working the late night shift in an empty building. Okay, buddy. Nope. Que se escuchan ruidos extraños en el baño. Yo, turn on some lights, <laughs> man. las mujeres. Why is everything gone? Oh my god, the fucking car. Oh, did you oh. Someone find that driver. He needs a beaten. He needs a beaten. The car scared me, bro. The fucking car scared me. Jesus Christ. Why does the car have to go by at the same time? Oh, hell no, I'll be out of there. 
I'll be fucking out of there. How to the no? Hey, bewitch, appreciate the five, give the bewitch. I need toilet as well. Now and I think the ghost should be in my toilet. From there. Wait, you guess what? Else? That's what I'm doing. So you have fun, do I'm looking at it, it's even moving, I can't see the quality shit. Is it moving? I cannot tell if it's moving bro, I've got bad eyes. Bad eyes plus it's bad quality, I can't tell. I uh, can't tell. Okay, now I can tell. Yep, Santa I can see that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something is moving in one of okay. the chairs. The security guard retreats to the back of the Thank building. You, Lambert. But everywhere he goes, new terrors await. Well, buddy, have you ever seen Conjuran? Come on, man. Have you ever seen Conjuran, bro? It's attached to you, bro. You got to chop off your back. Sorry, man. Hey, Kla, 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 with a five gift. Appreciate Kla. <laughs> Dios, qué susto me pegué. No, this guy's got to quit work. If he ain't quit work, I don't believe it. Stop moving like that, bro. Yo, chat, this is really bad because we got 10 minutes left for this video and I really need the piss. Like, really bad. And I don't want to go and break up this video. So I really hope I don't get scared to the point where I piss myself. Like, it's actually a possibility to, like, in this video, I might genuinely piss myself. I don't know. What was that? What was what? I didn't see anything. I see the door closed, then. If you notice, some odd white shape can be seen appearing in the doorway just before the door closes. The video ends there. Am I Some blind? say because the security guard fled his post. Am I blind? But what do you think? Is it a haunted office building? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? You decide. I Looming see that. overhead. This next creepy story comes from Brett Hayes, who works at a high school in Covalo, California. Brett says that he was sent into the school to assess any damage to school desks and property after a senior prank day. Yeah, Isaac, I've heard it, bro. You can thank Simsy for that one, dude. He took two pictures to show the state of the school's hallway. When he took a closer look, he noticed this. Some strange shadowy mass or being seems to be forming near one of the classroom doors. Okay. The mass appears to be standing right across from the school's attic access doors. At first, this might seem like an inconsequential detail, but soon, someone or something can be heard crawling through the school's attic. Are you mad? Bro, this is easily solved. It's obviously a kid trying to skip school, bro. It's obviously a kid trying to, you know, leave. What else could it be? I don't know if you could uh, hear that, but... The ants, yeah, it could be ants. That's footsteps above me, and I'm the only one here. And uh, there's only one way to get up there. Okay. Oh, this is creepy. Okay, it's about 4.30, oh, and I'm by myself. There's only one way to get up there, though. And you could tell with all this stuff that's messed up, the seniors did their senior prank, senior sneak. Wait, what is this school for, bro? My school won't look like this. What's happening in the school? They're rocking out. Okay, I see, but there's only one way in there to 
the attic and that's locked and I remember locking that and there's no other way in there but it's there's someone in the attic and I'm too scared to look okay let's go back in here Yo, imagine if just some like just homeless guy just falls down from here now. Just some crackhead. See, that's what it sounds like when they've been in there. Like they're when they're in the attic and you're in this room. That's what it sounds like. I'm too scared right now to look, but that is. Hey, Mr. Frog with the five gifted, bro. Thanks so much for the five, dude. It's an ounce. I gotta, I gotta go ask guy to decide. It's giving me anxiety. So, yeah, hell no. what do you think? Is the I high school I'll never haunted, go to school again. Or is this merely the sound of some overactive raccoons in the attic? Yeah, but what Let was me that know figure what you then? Think. Like, I believe there could be raccoons in the attic, bro. But what was that figure? Um, in the night, a Nuke's top five viewer named Nick told me a bizarre story about his old apartment. He says that after multiple strange events. He became convinced that his apartment was haunted. Hey, Frog, appreciate you for real, bro. And I hope you have an amazing day too, man. One night, Nick hears footsteps in the hall outside his room. Even creepier, he hears the distinct sound of the attic door opening and closing all on its own. He pulls out his phone and begins to record. Hey, yo, bro, you can't do this. P oh my god. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god. Now you just made us all feel like we're sucking you off. Put a top, bro, put a top on. Why are you doing this POV, bro? You know what this POV is. You know what this POV is. You hear weird noises. Put a top on, bro. The door has been like opening and closing. Yo, what the f <laughs> Yo. Another night, as Nick is relaxing with his dog Polly, strange things can be heard from his bedroom. Polly, what was that? Oh, I was going to say the dogs don't seem bothered. I was going to say dog don't seem bothered, but now it does. I believe dogs. Are you bothered, dog? Are you bothered? Okay, yep, dog's bothered. Okay, now that's weird. Yo. Okay, that's weird. Go on, dog, check it out. What's in there? Nick is finally fed up. What the fuck are these poles, bro? What the fuck are these poles? He decides to set up his own unique ghost test with some PVC pipes. What? You know, no strings, anything. Just in case one of them actually does fall over. Fan is off. Alright. If there's anything in here, knock one of these things over. Bro, that might be the most annoying fan puller I've ever seen in my life. The amount of times you're gonna walk into that is gonna be annoying. Can you not make it like a bit shorter, bro? Sure enough, a couple of the pipes fall seemingly on their own. Give me a roof cam right now. I think you I think your bitch ass has turned into Spider-Man and you're at the top of the fucking ceiling going. 
Nah, get, I want roof cam. I want roof cam. Give me roof cam. See how That's easy cool. they drop. Blowing it, blowing it. But now, is this proof of a paranormal presence? Or is it simply the influence of gravity on some lightweight PVC? You decide. The, the string was a bit weird. That, that was definitely weird movement, bruh. The string was definitely weird movement, bruh. Ghost Hitchhiker. Model Myrtle Sorosa and her crew were traveling abandoned back roads near eastern Samar in the Philippines on their way home from an event. This is an area where many people have lost their lives due to the frequent typhoons in the area. This stretch of road is said to be haunted by their ghosts. Sure enough, Myrtle and her friends have a scary encounter that they aren't expecting. Well, why are they driving in the middle of the road? Oh my god, what is that? But, hey, I got a couple of questions. I got a couple of questions. Firstly, why are you driving in the middle of the road? Secondly, how many fucking people is in this car? How many people? Bro, this car sounds like a concert, mate. How many people is in this car? Myrtle swears that she and her friends very clearly saw a little boy crouched in the roadway with his face in his hands as if weeping. Well, this isn't a fucking ghost video. This is a sad story. Someone's obviously fucking left the kid off. The kid's fucking abandoned. And you just drove past it. Now the kid's probably going to be fucking dead. They stopped further down the road and checked the dash cam, sure that they would see the sad little boy on the video. But instead, the dash cam had just recorded a strange white blob in the middle of the road. Would I pick it up? Yes. Bro, of course I would. Of course I would. On the scary video, the odd apparition seems to just disappear as they pass. So is this a ghost caught on camera in the middle of the road? Disappear. Bro, you drove past it. It didn't... You drove past... It didn't, it didn't, it didn't disappear. You, when you drive, this happens. It goes out of you. It didn't disappear, buddy. It's still there. On the scary video, the odd apparition seems to just disappear as they pass. It did. So is this a ghost caught on camera there. in the middle of the road? And if not, just what is that bizarre white mass that's right in the roadway? Hey, someone needs to go back to the... I don't know how old this video is. Someone needs to go back to this road. There might be a missing kid, bro. You decide. There might be a missing kid, bro. Even though I can't even see a kid. I just see, like, a white blob. I don't even know what that is. I can't even see it. Like, bro, what is that? Is that a kid in a fucking... A, a chicken egg? Is that a kid being hatched? I don't know, bro. What, what, what kid is this? I don't even see a fucking kid. I just see a white blob. I see a white blob. I don't know about that one, bro. 
The scariest thing to me in that video, bro, was the fact that how many people was in that car. That was quite, bro, they, they, was, they was sounded like there was 10 plus people in that car. That's a hazard right there. That's a fucking hazard.